we would like to add the ability to organize our list of tasks. To achieve this, we will need to add a categories table. Each category will have a category ID, as well as a category name. Make sure to mark category ID as a primary key and as an identity. Let's also add a category ID foreign key field to tasks. Drag the field onto categories to form the foreign key relationship. In the application generator, let's refresh the database schema, click on the project name, and press refresh. Let's modify the tasks model to add the new field. Check the box next to category ID field. Right click and press connect to categories. Let's include the category name field as an alias for the lookup and save the model. Let's also create a model for categories. Go ahead and save the default model. Continue to regenerate the application. Notice that an additional categories page has been added to our app. The category name field is now present on the list of tasks. The field is also present on the form. Type in to search for a category. We can also create categories inline. Let's assign categories to all of our tasks. We can press Ctrl F or the search icon in the top right corner to search for a category. We can also use the column header dropdown to filter by the category. Let's switch to the calendar. Due to the fact that category is the first foreign key in tasks, colors will be automatically assigned based on the category. The application framework will automatically detect foreign key and other special fields in the controller and use these fields to compose a set of charts. By visiting the categories page, we can view a list of categories.